YouTube, this is Theodore 0 and Silver Kitty 101. And we're actually doing a instead of a mod, a 1.8 snapshot. Look at that laser beam! Uh so 1.8 came out literally today. Uh we have seen one glitch over there and one change right here. Uh you must have seen a snap you must have seen a little bit of the glitch right. Oh right there's the glitch. Uh well so right here's the guardian that was added right here's the sheep now if I just get a sword silver close your eyes boom mutton poor sheepies well you guys and weren't wolf. you guys weren't colored so I don't care alright right here's some endermite I just named uh silver just named them number two so that they don't despawn endermite uh, if I just spawn in an Enderman, I, I'm not sure if they change this, but it would be fun. I'm gonna kill him. Not gonna kill him. Come on, I'm recording for YouTube. Kill him. Kill this dude. Kill him. Kill him. Come on. Murder these th Of course I don't. Well, these Endermites will spawn. Uh, when you open a ender chest or an enderman teleports and it's supposed to be where I just killed the last one squid. Wow. Well, it's supposed to be they kill uh, The enderman will hate them so much that they run into water. Of course they didn't right then. I don't know why Right here's the villagers. I know villagers have been here for a long time But they have gotten a big change that if you ever watch F ethos lab you could see the potential. Of course, I destroy that. No, it's okay. Uh, hello. Can you guys uh just go and pay this? Come on, guys. We're paying you. Of course, they don't do it when uh I'm recording. Here, I'm gonna oh, pay you. Oh, what those uh, There's a bunny. I'll get back to these guys when they actually do it. These are the bunnies. We got this one right here, number three. We got a little baby one because I just bred them. And right here, oh. It's Mr. Evil. Oh, they're actually harvesting. Wow. Ugh, I cannot jump. So as you see, they actually harvested. Uh, Look at the evil bunny. So Look at the evil bunny. Right here is what's called the evil bunny. Uh, it doesn't always have the name tag. I don't know why, it just is. Uh, there's a bunch of bunnies over here. They spawn in Plains Biome from what I have gathered. Uh, right here was going to be for the Elder Guardian. It's just, uh, I wasn't able to get him. So right here is one thing that they are saying that they would add, but they didn't. Get in silver and go forward. Oh, it's not on the track. Silver! And I'm supposed to make sure it's on the track. As you can see, she's going the same speed as she was. Now, to continue on mobs, a uh, glitch I have found is this mob right here, the Guardian, as you can see, has been inside this area for what has now been an hour and eight minutes. And these are supposed to be squids and die on land. Actually, I think I think it, he's um, staying on land because you named him. Uh, no, that's just so he doesn't despawn. Naming doesn't affect anything with its characteristics. Okay. So the now, blocks. time for the blocks. Get on the blocks. Right here is the stone and cobblestone. That is what we're most used. That's what we're most used to. Then there's the granite. And if you're anywhere from where I live, granite is everywhere. There's the durite. Uh, not sure if I pronounced that right, but yeah. Uh, that is also pretty common. And the night, uh, not sure if I pronounced that either, uh, correctly. That is less common, but still pretty common inside your world. Coarse dirt. If you hoe I'm not sure where you get that from, but silver, go. If you hoe coarse dirt, and I've tested this, if you hoe, if you hoe coarse dirt, it turns to regular dirt, and then if you keep hoeing it, like, again, it turns into hoed land or farmland. There we go. Right here is sponge. Uh, not new to Minecraft, but right here is a wet sponge. When you put a sponge inside the water, you get a wet sponge. I when you kill the el when you kill an elder, 
guardian. You get a sponge and that kind of stuff. All right, here's prismarine. This is prismarine block. That's a sea lantern. That's dark prismarine. Then, for the first time ever in all of Minecraft, there's red sandstone. Red sandstone, red chiseled sandstone, red smooth sandstone, red sandstone stairs, and red sandstone slabs. Now, if you have ever seen the Colossus inside Minecraft, they use the slime blocks like crazy in that. Or the guy used it. And the slime blocks are pretty cool. Now, right here is one of my demonstrations for a slime block. If you could change your game mode, Silver. You actually all do it. J-M-E-M-O-D-E. Zero silver. Boom. Hop on. Yep, just hop on. And now if I just flip this lever. Wow. She flies. <laughs> I'm flying, guys. People Another thing fly. is I'll just show you this. Um if you jump onto one of these, uh here, do you want me to do it? Success! No, I'll do it. Uh, this is already a great video. We're off to a great start. I want to jump. Yeah, but I want to jump off the side, too. There, I jumped. Eh. You missed. Eh. Boom! It takes all fall damage, of course. Ah, uh, there we go. I'll be right there. Right here is the granite. Uh, and it's night, and come on, where is it? That's a skeleton, that's a bat, and right there is a glitch. Right here is also a glitch, and right here is the derite. As you can see, they are all pretty common in your world. Um, hey, let's do a armor stuff. Well, not yet, we still have a bunch of stuff to go through. Uh, so. Over here is another thing that you could use slime blocks for. And first of all, before I get yelled at for my bad redstone skills, and that it is becoming night, and we have villagers. I'll be right back. Um, my computer I'm on keeps logging me out. Well, uh, I before I get yelled at for bad redstone, I have no idea how to use this, because it just came out today, so yeah. Not much Boom. wasting time. You can use uh, this. You can use the slime blocks to move other blocks. And if you just look at my redstone skills, not really. I use one sticky piston. I don't even know if I needed that. One repeater and a bunch of redstone. I don't even need the repeater. I know that for sure. And, so, and Theo, you're really good at redstone in our in our. Yeah. So right here's a little bunny. Bunnies! No, no one sees me. Right here's an armor stand. Silver, get out. Right there's a zombie head on Silver's. <laughs> uh, armor stands are pretty cool. Uh, I don't know the crafting recipe, and I don't even know if there is one right now. But yeah. Right here is trap door. And iron trap door, which is actually you know something that I was considering. Or I was actually considering. Or, uh, well, no, any redstone yeah, current. I was actually thinking about adding the uh, iron trap door to our mod craft that we're using for dinosaur and that kind of stuff. But as you can see, I see you can now I place buttons on the floor. I think we should have in, um, the security mod. Uh, no, we shouldn't because there's already an iron trap door now. Oh, we got the acacia wood fence and fence gate. Got dark oak. That's what I used over there for the fence gate. Uh, for the gate. I think that would look good in a castle. We got jungle. I'm gonna use that a lot. We got birch. And then we got spruce. Now on to the doors. This is my favorite. We got dark oak door. We got acacia. Which one is this? This is jungle. We got jungle. That's a pretty good look. We got birch. Obviously, you could tell. Right here is spruce. This is normal oak. And right here is the iron. Of course, now you cannot just put... Oh, I'll put a spruce, an oak, and a birch in to make a door. 
Or you, you can't, can't do, do that anymore. The, you can you can't just do it oak, a spruce, a birch. You can't mix match wood is what we're saying. Yeah. Right here is not all the banners, but this is all the banners in the creative menu. Yeah. Uh again, I don't know that's a glitch. I don't know all of the actual uh, recipes for the banners. I'm running through banners. Uh this did come out today. And I don't watch snapshot videos nor play snapshots. Because it does ruin the snapshot for me. Right here is colored beacons. Oh, we got yellow. We got every color of stained glass. Plus, you can add them, as you can see, make to make uh, mixes. See? Yeah, I was if originally going to do that. Like, have it only one beacon and up. And try to get nice colors and, and stuff like that, but Theo said no, we need all different. And I think they look kind of cool, actually. This is like my favorite part about it. You can just run through them. Beat and, me up, Scotty! And you can have like, um, you can play like a capture the flag with these. Yeah, you that would do, be cool. Um, you can do it like territories, you can do it like, this is my place, this is your place. This is my land. It only might not. Oh, uh, well. It's my late, too. Uh, he's still alive. I'm gonna have to check if he actually could die. Um, and if you're wondering why this river right here is not a river, you don't have to come back. I'm uh, just about to show the custom worlds. Oh. Is because this is actually drought. I saw a drought in the custom worlds when I was playing around with it, and I thought it was hilarious. I live inside Texas. I live inside Houston, Texas. Last year, we had, it's okay, we had 100 degree weather, a lot. Not this year. Here. Not this year at all. This was a cold year, 90 to 80 degree weather, that's freezing. Uh, just about. Um, but we are in the middle of a drought right now. So I'm just going to jump over to custom worlds and show you guys all the custom worlds. See you in a second. Okay, so now we're in the custom world settings. You can set anything from the sea level to, well, maximum block height. You can, uh, you can do your own height. You can go all the way down to zero. You can turn on and off caves, villages, temples, ravines, strongholds, mine shafts, ocean monuments, dungeons, uh, water lakes, lava lakes, lava oceans. I normally turn on lava oceans and off lot water lakes because that's awesome. You can have dungeon counts, water lake variety, lava lake variety, biome, uh, biome size, and river size. You go to the next page, spawn size, down to one, spawn tries, don't know what that is. Oh, wait, this is dirt, oka, gravel. You know, like 50. Uh, gravel. And you can just change all the really common stuff to uh, how many it spawns. Even diamond, uncommon stuff. Redstone, diamond, lapis. Well, not lapis or redstone. You can do advanced settings. I'm not an expert, so I don't know anything about it. And there's this. Don't know anything about it either. There's Prezi's, which is Water World. Oh, that's cool. They added more up there. Isla Island. Uh, Caver's Delight, which if you do like to mine and do like mountains and that kind of stuff in cool looking areas, your world. Mountain Madness. This is for you mad people. Uh, drought. That was what we're on the last time. There's very little water and that kind of stuff. Caves of Chaos. That's just about the entire world is caves. And then good luck. There's all water is changed to lava. Every single last bit. So, in all gratitude, good luck. Uh, you can randomize it. Uh, then you can do defaults. No, I don't. So, I'm just going to... Go on, check out good luck. Done. Create new world. For all you guys sitting at home, goodbye YouTube. Oh, there's a descript for my description of my uh, channel. If I remember, inside 
the description. A link to our channel in the description. Good